Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back with the fall look, and so I think I'll just go ahead and get started. I've actually tried this video one other time, and it didn't quite work. So I'm back trying it for a second time here, and I did go ahead and start with the Lumi Glow uh, lotion in 902. I mix that with the Milani uh, bronzing drops in 110 and this is the lightest shade for the Milani. It tends to go pretty gold and then I mixed in the Revolution Skin Silk in F2 so I have all three of these on as far as my base today. And as far as what I did for lip uh, today I did go ahead and use the Wet n Wild and this is Shock Value and this is actually from the Nightmare Before Christmas collection. And then I added some of the e.l.f. Uh, lip oil in jam. So that's what I have on for the lips there. And then um, I did use some of this as a base for the cheeks as well. And uh, again, this is a lip and cheek, so you can use it both places, and it's a liquid. And I think the colors I came out with for this collection are just so pretty. Uh, they're very fall inspired, and like I said, I used shock value today, which is a pretty orangey one. And then um, I did go ahead and use the NYX Buttermelt, and I picked up the two face palettes. They're coming out for this holiday. They're over at NYX and over at Ulta. And so I did go ahead and use these today. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. So I did go ahead and use this one as my bronzer today. And then I put some of this over the top as blush. And um, again, I did go ahead and use the shock value as a base for the blush today. So that's what I have on there. And then I did go ahead and use the Daybreak as far as the highlighter today. So yeah, I have a whole bunch of different um, thing, And I love the Buttermilk formula. I just think that it's really good. And it, um, yeah, now I have this one upside down. <laughs> so um, I would recommend going ahead and picking up either of these. They're really good palettes, and I'm really enjoying them. And uh, let's see, what else did I do today? Um, I did go ahead and use the Panorama Mascara by L'Oreal and the Essence Volume Stylist. And then I used the Essence Make Me Brow and Brown. So that's what I did for the eyes. Um, and as far as my palette, it's been one of those days. I left it right on the other side of the room, so I'll be right back. Okay, so back and the palette is the Earthy Palette by Beauty Bay, and this is back in stock over at Beauty Bay, and um, it's a really good palette. When Beauty Bay does a palette like this, they'll do a 42-pan palette, a 16-pan palette, and a 9-pan palette, and um, so I went ahead and got the 42-pan palette. This is the way it looks. The formula that Beauty Bay uses is usually pretty spectacular. Um, I've actually never found a palette that I didn't like from them. And so this um, has a whole bunch of those really pretty fall colors. If you want uh, to go ahead and do a bunch of fall looks uh, and you really want every green that you would ever need, this palette will go ahead and do that for you. And so as far as what I have on today, I did go ahead and start with this shade, and I did that from the inner corner up, and then I did go ahead and use this shade right under the eye. Um, I went ahead and used this green, which is actually more of a grassy green on the outer corner. I used this for my eyeliner here, and then I did go ahead and use this shade right here as far as um, on the lid itself. Um, I think the... It always comes, uh, Beauty Bay has wonderful formula, it really does, and for the size of these palettes and the quality, I don't think $35 is too much to ask, and that's usually how much these run. Um, it does take a little time to ship because they are in the UK, and so it can take about two weeks to go ahead and get a palette from them. I mean, you can always do expedited shipping if you wanted to, but usually that's two to three weeks to go ahead and get something from across the ocean. And um, yeah, 
it's a beautiful palette, great quality, and like I said, if you want every shade that you can think of, this palette will go ahead and be every shade that you need. And I'm so glad that they have it back in stock because I would consider this one of their classic palettes, and I'm glad that they brought it back. And so, um, yeah, and um, like I said, they do do the 42 pan, uh, 16 pan, and a 9 pan, and it, it'll be some of the shades from this and the 16 pan, some of the shades from this and the 9 pan. And so I would really highly go ahead and recommend it. I think I already, well, yeah. Again, that's how the look turned out, and it's just really pretty fall look with all sorts of fall colors in there, and um, yeah, just really happy with the way that the look turned out, and I hope that you have a great day, and I'll see you later.